Hi guys, welcome to today's video. Today, I wanna break down how to get paid for your passion because that's the dream, right? Like if you are in a nine to five that you don't really enjoy or you even kind of dread going to every day, imagine waking up and diving into work where for every single hour you get paid to work on things that you find fulfilling, that you are inspired by, and in the ways that you wanna make a difference, in things that you would just go and research and learn about and tell your friends about on your own anyway. So that is what I wanna break down today. And if anything, I totally resonate with where you're at because only a few years ago, I was also in a nine to five where I honestly enjoyed the work day to day, but it wasn't my passion. I just had this feeling that there was more out there, um, that my days, it couldn't just be all about going and working for this other company um, where I just didn't feel like fulfilled in my heart doing that work. Um, but I had no idea how to actually get to a place where I could get paid for my passion. And so I tried all kinds of side hustles. I finally found my way to freelance writing. And even if you're not a writer, I want to share with you a few ideas to get paid for your passion and maybe even working from home, wherever you please, anywhere around the world on your own schedule, all right? So here are a few steps to turn your passion into an actual profitable business as your own boss. So the first step to get clear is to make a list of the things that you are passionate about. <laughs> this is the simple first step, but it's really important. If you aren't really sure what you're passionate about, if it's been a while since you've considered it, go and make a list of anything that you spend time researching online as soon as you get home from work. Maybe there are things that friends and family always ask you for help with or advice around. You know, maybe there is something that you love doing in your free time. Uh, maybe there are side hustles you're already investing in or certifications or education that you are considering pursuing. Go and make a list of all of those things, all right? That's like the first step and it's gonna give you a lot of ideas to work with, to show you kind of if there's a big market for you. Once you do that, the second thing is to spend 30 minutes researching companies in those industries. So for example, let's say you are really into wellness and health and fitness and nutrition as your passion. Go and start thinking about all of the companies in that realm. You can use Google to look up top wellness companies, top gyms, top nutrition companies, top fitness equipment. You can think about companies in your own town. So there's obviously gyms, there's nutritionists, um, there's personal trainers, you know, there are local healthy restaurants. And then on the more national scale, Go to your cupboard and see all the different food companies that you already purchase. Um, maybe there's healthy brands, maybe there are supplements, um, maybe there's equipment that you have stored for your home workouts, maybe there are people you follow online. So go and your second task after you make a list of your passions is to make a list of all of the companies in that industry. Big, small, medium, local, national, what that's going to do is it's going to show you, and I think you'll be surprised how many there are, all the potential companies that you could write for to make extra money. So if you look at that list, and let's say you come up with 25 or even 50 companies, it might not even take you a half hour, it might take you 10 minutes. Think about all of those companies, and they all have blog posts to create, they have social media, they have email newsletters they send out, they might have a podcast where they need descriptions, they might have YouTube videos where they need the little descriptions and, and video notes. So all of that is content that they need help writing and that they really probably don't have time to complete themselves. Maybe they don't feel like that's their strong suit. Maybe the health area is where they really thrive, but the content they feel a little confused by. So that all is an opportunity with every one of those companies to write all of those pieces of content for them. The blog posts, social media, YouTube, emails, web pages, sales pages, everything, right? That's so much. It's all an opportunity for you to go and make money. Now, the third thing that you need to do is, if you don't know already, you need to learn how to write and how to pitch those clients. 
Um, and there's a lot of free resources online. You can check out my channel. I have a free training below if you are interested in learning the steps involved in earning $100 an hour writing for businesses online. Um, and in my programs, I teach how to write and how to also understand content strategies like SEO, um, search engine optimization, and all of those things that right away make you not just a writer, but an, a strategist and a marketer. And that added skill set immediately positions you to charge more premium rates, like $50 to $100 an hour. So if you've ever heard of, you know, that writers can't make money or that copywriters make $20 or $40 an hour, that may be true for the average, but once you learn added skill sets, you immediately stand out from the average writer, which helps you get work more easily and quickly, and you also can command more premium rates because you're not just a writer, but you're a partner and a strategist and a marketer for these brands. So I teach all of that in my program. If you're interested, again, I'll drop a free resource below this video um, that you can check out to dive deeper. But regardless of how you go about it, learn to write and learn how to get those clients. And another myth that I wanna bust is anyone can learn to write. So even if you don't have writing experience, you know, I have trained writers for years in corporate America, people coming in who were new to marketing, new to writing. I eventually built an agency where I trained writers every single day. And now in my programs, I teach people how to go from beginner to proficient in a matter of eight weeks. And so anyone can learn to write. I have never met one person who cannot do it with the right system and mentorship. And so if that's something that's holding you back or that you think this all sounds great, but I don't know how to write, that's okay. It's so learnable. And again, you can do it online through free resources, webinars, training programs. Um, you can do a more of a mentorship step-by-step -step program like I provide. Um, but whatever you do, learn to write because that is a skill that you can then take and you can apply to that long list that you made in the beginning of this video of your passions and of all those companies that need your help um, writing content, writing blogs, social media, podcasts, YouTube, and so on, web pages, all that stuff. And you can then position yourself to go and with your writing background, with your content strategy background, you can position yourself to charge 50 to $100 an hour writing for those businesses. Imagine what that would do for you to be able to wake up and to think about all the passions you listed in that first step and to get to go and write things that not only are fun to write because you are passionate about the topic, but actually make a real difference. One for the business owner who desperately needs help from a writer and a trained professional to get their message out in the world. They don't know probably how to write. They probably know how to do what they're good at, but they really could use your help translating their mes message, their passion into words so it helps them, and then it also helps all the people around the world who need that product or service, who could benefit from finding a nutritionist or a trainer or a healthy food or a way of eating that feels good, um, or whatever your passion is, that's just our wellness example. So if you are passionate about something else, maybe you're passionate about good parenting, Imagine all the parents who are struggling with getting their babies to sleep or figuring out um, how to navigate sibling rivalry. Like you could teach them that. If you're passionate about DIY or home renovation, imagine going and being able to teach someone how to make their home feel beautiful or how to take stuff that they have at home and turn it into um, something that makes their kitchen feel amazing and that they can make family memories in. So again, your passion will be different you can use whatever it is because you have that long list of companies that you can already get started with and go and pitch. Um, the step for you may just be either pitching those companies right now if you already know how to write or first maybe learning that step of how to write and be a marketer, be a content strategist and then going down that list of every single company that you named and reaching out to them for support and getting started with your first writing projects. That is what I would recommend and what I have done in my life for turning my passions into profits, into things I can get paid for, um, working from anywhere, on my own schedule, as my own boss, and making a good money, good income doing it so that I can go out and do work that's fulfilling and that helps people and then do more good in the world. 
So I hope this is helpful. And again, if you are curious about learning um, how to get started and what the steps would be, I'll drop a free training below this video um, to hope it supports you as well. Have a great day.